third element of incorporating sustainability in your policies is your investing. Now, you may be asking yourself, well, I don't really control that or, you know, our company, you know, they're just going to put the money where they, where they are always going to put it in their bank or in their short-term investments or, you know, wherever they've done it. Well, let's think about it. Where your money goes is really saying where your mouth is going. So if you're trying to reduce your social environmental impact or have a more positive contribution to society, your money can make that. And using sustainability criteria as a screen is an important way of doing it. There's three areas where we're going to talk about it. Equity investments are those, those, those holdings you might have, a short-term stock that you're going to hold on to. Your debt might be loans that you have or bonds that you make. And where you bank, or if you use a bank at all, whether it's that or a credit union, really can have an impact of making sure that you're putting your money where your mouth is. And by creating a sustainable policy on this, you can find it's, it's not that difficult a way of putting your money for good as opposed to putting it where it's been traditionally been for the long term. One of the benefits of a sustainable investment policy is that we see that companies that put their money in funds such as, you know, that are organizations like the Dow Jones Sustainability Index actually outperform traditional investment funds. During the financial crisis, companies that had sustainability focus in what they were doing from an environmental, social, and governance perspective actually outperform those that did not by an average margin of $650 million in market cap. So there is a financial benefit to be thinking about these things and using your money to help your other social environmental goals just like you would anything else. And one of the biggest things that you're going to come up against is that you know, people will say, well, we need to maximize every last dollar for this company. We can't be you know, putting away our savings or our, our short-term investments into some socially responsible investment fund, we need to maximize our return because that's money that we can invest in capital or operations or uh, raises for our employees or new capital purchases. What this slide shows here is that the sustainable option can outperform the traditional option. Here's an example where those companies that were part of the Dow Jones Sustainability Index actually outperform the Dow. Now this is over a period of, you know, before the financial crisis, during the financial crisis, coming out of it, you know, after this little blip we've had most recently, you're seeing that companies that had social environmental criteria actually outperformed those that did not. So if you're trying to, as a company, say, well, we'd like to put a portion of our 401k money into socially responsible investment funds, or we'd like to put a portion of our banking or our uh, short-term investments into social responsible investment funds, you don't have to worry about them getting a lower return. In some cases, they can actually outperform. So what are these different investment policy types? Now, obviously, there's negative screens like the traditional SRI funds where they're saying, let's have no tobacco, alcohol, nuclear, you know, gambling. You know, have ESG, which stands for Environment, Social, and Governance, where they're actually investing in value-based companies, things that are missing from the market. You have impact investing, which is investment in solutions that are not only um, innovative, but also profitable. Or clean energy is obviously a hot topic for people that want to put their money towards sustainable and sustainable investing. And you can invest in rural energy projects. So you're wondering, where, where are these funds? Well, this is a, an incomplete list that I'm putting up here, but this shows you all the different types of sustainable finance products that are out there. If you're trying to say, well, we want to have sustainable investing as part of our you know, overall company policy, here are products for green bonds, for triple online banking. If you're looking for venture capital money, if you're looking to put money into more sustainable real estate, mutual funds, private placement products, SRI specific funds, or even asset management, there are a number of products out there. Take a look at these. You'll find that they're doing all quite well and could do well for your organization.